Hello once again, Dynamic Family. My name is Dynamo, and welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. We are back with Sekiro Shadows Die Twice Part 9. We had just left off where we had beaten the Armored Warrior on the bridge. Uh, in probably one of the most surprising ways that I've ever beaten an enemy. by uh, Kind of just by accidentally doing it and finding out how to beat him. Uh, it wasn't on purpose, it was completely by random coincidence that I managed to beat him that time. So uh, yeah, we did that, which was pretty fun. <laughs> We managed to make our way up a little bit more on the Senpu, ah, Senpu Mountain temples that are up here. So we ran into one of the older looking shriveled dudes and apparently there was like a really big like centipede that like popped out of him and it attacked us, almost kicked our ass and so we decided to leave it alone and then just trek up a little bit further and from there we just been beating some monks and stuff and then we are going to fight that little boss over there. Uh, I forget what this boss's name is. I know it has something to do with the centipede again. Probably gonna have to do a little bit more of a stealthy approach because those two guys down there are gonna be a little bit annoying to deal with. So I should probably take them out first. That is pretty much the plan for the moment. So without any further delay, let's get right back into the action. Okay, so last time what I did is I directly jumped onto the big guy, got his health down one. I should probably do that again. Again. Actually, you know what? No, hold on. Let me use my shurikens. Yeah, let's do that. Alright, he's dead. Oop. Alrighty. Maybe have this guy de aggroed a little bit. That way I can kill him. Come on, turn around. Yes, yes, I know. You hate me. You hate me with a passion. I just need one more good hit on him. No. No! You son of a. Okay, fine. Of course, this little board has to be the one thing that is blocking me. Like, oh my god. Okay, but it's fine. Honestly, all we need to do is we need to take half of this guy's health. Just have him de aggro real quick. There we go. Okay. And then what we're gonna do is. Hmm, Nah, not that. Oh, no, he moved. He saw me, again. How is he still seeing me? Dude, just de-aggro, please. Please de-aggro. Like, we get it. He's super smart, but like, come on now. De-aggro, de-aggro. You can't see me. You can't see me. Good job. Good boy. Alright. And... Jump. There we go. Immediately get this one. There we go. Alright. Now, move, 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 move. Okay, so... What are we trying to do? <laughs> Try not to get caught in that huge-ass attack that he's doing. Ah, uh, wow. That did not go to plan at all. Well, that's fantastic. My entire plan basically went out the window. Oh my god. Okay, I'll be back. One second. Just one second. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I just ran past every single enemy on the way here. I don't really care. It's okay. That's fine. I don't need to defeat every single enemy. Grab the coins. Okay. So, we're going to try this again. See if we can't do it right this time. Never mind. God 
damn. Is this the only attack he does? Oh, god damn. Yo. There we go. Okay. I totally forgot that blocking and attacking him can do damage to his posture. Fuck! I gotta remember to jump up with that one. It's okay, we're good. Heal again. We're gonna get our defense up just a little bit. Nope. Not Shit. Ugh, bro, I am so close. I know I have him. God damn it. Buck. Alright, we're back. Just gonna jump right into it. So I'm sick of this dude. Alright. So, now I know that the best way to beat him is to mostly block him. These guys I can deal with on the ground. Easy. Alright, there's one. No, 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 no. Okay. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to get this side singled out. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Or is he dead already? No, oh my god, dude, just let me let me kill you, please. Oh my god. Come on. Dude, really? Why is he so fast? Holy shit. Leave me alone. There we go. God damn. Come on. go. Fuck you. Oh, finally. Jesus. Okay. First of all, sorry that that was so in there. I just kind of said, throw all the costumes to the wind and just fucking kill the dude. Sorry. I just kind of got a little pissed off there. I'm good now. I'm fine. <sighs> Take a deep breath. We're good. All right. We're cool. Uh, I gotta turn this line down too, holy shit. Uh, yellow gunpowder, amber colored grains forming the base for uh, powerful gunpowder, a precious commodity only found in the Sunken Valley. Used for explosive prosthetic tool upgrades for intermediate and higher rank. 
The yield from uh, yellow powder is greater than the, of the black, lending the valley stronghold defense against the fire bee victory. Very cool. And another prayer bead. Hell yeah. Alright, but seriously, fuck that dude. I hate him. God. Super annoying. Also, what was that one little flip that I did there? Like, I was blocking him for a minute, and then when he did, like, the like the death thing to come and grab me, I jumped, and then I did something. I don't know what exactly it was that I did, but it was super cool. I, like, jumped on top of him and just, like, staggered him. It was, like, sick. Alright, now that we're done with that, we can finally get out of here. Uh, can we go up this way? We cannot. Okay, so we have to go back this way. Yeah, God, that dude was unrelenting. I was like, how the hell am I going to beat this dude? And then I remembered, oh yeah, you can break posture if you block or if you attack him enough. So, I got to remember these things. I don't have a very good memory, as you can clearly tell. But we're fine. We've beaten him. All right, so now... Monks. Dead. Woo! Hello. There we go. He's dead too. Alright. Cool. And so now I'm go, we go this way, yeah? More on go sugar, sweet. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, shit, I didn't see you here, hello. There we go. Ah, oh, there's a guy with a shield here. Of course. Alright, switch our method up a little bit. There we go. Ha <laughs> ha! Not so tough without your shield, are you? Scrag magnetite. Sweet. And more scrap iron. I really need to go back to the dilapidated temple at some point and upgrade my stuff because I have not done that yet. I will admit that I am fairly ashamed that I have not done any of this yet. Okay, come on. There we go. Alrighty, cool. Also, another thing I wanted to mention, a somebody commented in one of my videos that to get rid of the what you call it again. Uh what is that called? The demon something. The bell demon. Yeah, I have to ring uh the bell that I have in my possession. So it's the the young I have to ring this, right? Or is that not how that works? He said something about ringing a bell. Uh, ho hold on. What did what did he say? Oh, if you use the demon bell in my inventory, then the hard mode goes away. So that's what he told me. So then I have to use this, yeah? All right, so use this. All right, and now the burden's dispelled. Okay, cool. So yeah, for anybody wondering how to get rid of that, that's how you do it. You just use the use the item once you've got it. Alright, well very cool. And thank you once again to uh let me see. BC Clutch, by the way. Thank you so much if you are watching this. I really appreciate your help. Alright. So now we're going to move up here. There's some guys over here that I cannot get. Past, um, yeah, I don't think I can sneak past him. I might have to just fight him. Well, actually, no, hold on. If he comes down here close enough, I can do this. Thank you, good sir. There we go. Makes it a lot easier for me. All right. What's going on up here? Oh, hello. Uh, 
Uh, oh, it's one of those guys again. I thought that was like a mini boss. I was like, who is that cool looking dude over there? I'm gonna see if I can sneak up on him. Hold on. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yep, yep, yep. Ah, uh, there's two. Of course they're standing back to back. Of course. Can't be that easy. Oh, and there's another one over there. Hello? Can I get at least one of them? There we go. Uh oh Oh! Ooh, back up. Holy shit. Okay, so these ones attack. Woo! Oh my... Oh my good lord. Okay, alrighty. These guys attack. Oh my god. Alrighty. Well, they kicked my ass. I I didn't really know their moveset because, again, they didn't attack me the first time I met them. They just dodged me and did that overhead thing. So I wasn't quite sure how to combat them. But uh, I will fast forward again, and uh, I'll see you guys in a, in a minute. I'll see you guys in a minute. Alright, we are back once again. We're going to try this again. There we go, there's one. Damn it. Yo, holy shit. I, can I get two seconds to at least, like, get my bearings? Holy shit, dude. These guys are very annoying. Okay. This is attacks are so... What the hell was that? Really? Bro. Oh my god. Rot Essence Crow Mob. Uh, somewhere a pain cough rings out continuously the coughing and wheezing sounds of a man who takes great pride in memorializing the dead. He holds service somewhere in Ashna outskirts. Owning this item reduces one's chances of receiving unteen aid. Alright, we got another one of those, and I'll be back in a minute again.
bastards. Hate every one of those guys. <sighs> Sorry that it took me so long to get back here. I had to take a moment and just like decompress. A lot of mixed emotions right now. I'll, I'll tell you that. But uh, I'm not trying to project it onto you guys or anything like that. It's just been uh, fairly rough for me as of late. And um, definitely... Definitely some emotions that I'm feeling at the moment, but I am fine. I'm good. I'm not broken or anything just yet, but uh, just going through a little rough patch, but we are fine. But yeah, I uh, decided to just go back through the entire area and kill every enemy. Um, and then with this last bit, I decided to just take them all one by one, de-aggro them, and then just kill them from behind. Because it's like the easiest thing that I can do as I cannot like beat them in any way shape or form at the moment with like my mental state right now so i'm just gonna i'm just gonna do that if there's another group like that that's probably what i'm gonna do so yeah now that we are finally out of that little conundrum there we can finally move forward also where the hell are we now this looks like a grave of some sort oh what are you? Oh, it's one of these guys again. Okay. We're good, we're good. Whoa. You know, it'd be great if you guys would stop throwing all these fireballs at me and let me attack you some. There we go. There we go, got him. Alright, cool. Ooh, more? One of them at least, because he's not looking. Sweet. Oh. Enough of the fireballs. Very long. Alright. Okay, did we miss anything back here? I don't... What is... Ooh, there's something over here? little tunnel of some sort. Hopefully it's not another headless down here. Very much appreciate it if it was not another headless. Okay, where are we going? If this is another headless, I swear. Please no. Because dark caves usually means one of those guys. Evil balloon of spirit. Sweet. And what's up here? Yeah, we're, we're just sneaking around right now. Ow. Ooh. Jesus. There we go. Oh. Excuse me. There we go. I am not doing the greatest right now. Uh, uh, hello? Who is you? Um, am I, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to hit you? I can't talk to him. That's, uh, strange. This guy is just kind of, kind of chill. He's got a bunch of centipedes on him. I don't like that. I can hit him, but I can't kill him. So, what was the point in coming here? Oh, there's this up here. That's probably why, because I didn't look up. Anybody up here? No, not from what I can see. More pellets, hell yeah. Which reminds me, I need to put pellets back into my inventory. Alright. Oh, look! There's the, uh, Sculptor's Auto down there. That's where we were at. Uh, okay. 
So there's like a main boss around here somewhere. Oh, what's this? Senpu Esoteric Text, a book of secrets that grants the ability to learn Senpu-style skills. Those are of the Senpu Temple Master of Martial Arts and the Pursuit of Virtue. They considered strong fists and strict discipline essential against Buddhist enemies. However, Senpu's temple was seized by an obsession for the Undying, which corrupted their teachings and style. Makes a lot of sense. Well, cool. Are you, do we have to do some hand-to-hand -hand combat? That'd be kind of goaded, not gonna lie. I would love to get into some Kung Fu. Shit. All right. Uh, is there anything else up here we need? I don't believe so. I think we're good. All right. So let's go back to where we were at. We can use this branch to get back over, I'm hoping. Yes. Oh, yes. I got to do it twice, though. All right. More Aqua Sugar. Oh, yeah. All right. That's where we went, and now we got to go this way. Hello? Anybody home? It is too... no. Please do not tell me that these are the enemies with the centipedes in them. I swear if they are. There cannot be this many of them. Honest. Was that a skull? <gasps> it is, yes! Oh, this is exactly what I needed. Who are you? All right, cool. At least we got to a saving point. That's the most important part. It's been a while since I've seen one of these. Ooh, also, while we're at it, we don't have any... Uh, no, we got purchased. All right, we're good. I don't believe I need to kill this guy. I can talk to him, though. We're going to ask about the holy person. I'm told that a special holy person lives here. Remarkably holy. That would be the child, I imagine. She's not here anymore. It's my fault. The child. She's confined within the inner sanctum. It's impossible to see her now. I see. Uh, are you a shinobi? Damn straight we are. If that's the case, then actually, I have a favor to ask of you. The child wanted to know the reason for her fate. If you do see her by some chance, please give her this. It's the least I can do for my own atonement. <laughs> Holy chapter, Infested, a passage describing a journey to enlightenment. For an age I have been blessed by the worm. To be undying is to walk the eternal path to enlightenment. Thus I must become enlightened to understand why I cannot die. It is said the holy dragon's origins were in the west, so I wonder, how did the worm come to be bestowed upon me? Alright. Alright, interesting. Is Anything else? Something else. This temple. It's 
too late to regret what you've already lost. Alrighty then. So apparently there is this child we need to find. I'm guessing that this child is kind of like the divine heir to these guys. Although what's happened to these guys is very strange. Do you see all the centipedes crawling on them? I feel like at one point there was something that like infected all of the people here. All of the monks and the, the Buddhists. And like that's the reason why this place fell in the first place. I'll have to look at the lore later. But yeah, I'm fairly certain that's what happened here. Because apparently they made the mistake of not watching their own, you know, their heir as well. But they kind of failed in their mission to protect them from what I'm guessing this is about. So, yes, hello. Oh, wait, no. These guys are... Yeah, these guys you can't kill. You can... I mean, you can kill them, but you can't kill them, if you know what I mean. They're not the ones with the centipedes, thank god. Those ones are very annoying to deal with. But these guys are kind of immoral. Ungo sugar, sweet. Oh, there's one. Yeah, see? These big, these big old centipede guys right here. Um, they. I'm not sure how they got like this because there is, there has to be something that came here at some point to make them have this thing in them. I'm not exactly sure. I'm interested to find out what exactly happened, but. But right now, I'm going to leave those guys alone because they're a little too powerful for my liking. So, yeah. Alright. Does not open from the side. Okay. Hmm. Can go up here. And, ooh, there's an item over there I missed. Whoops. No, 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 no. Oh. There we go. And over here. And what's this? Dragon's Blood Droplet. Ooh. Hell yeah. Just gives it to us. Good stuff. Lump of fat wax. Great. And this just goes back here. These guys, I'm assuming, are... Yeah, you can see it. You can see them sitting on it. That's gross. All right. Yeah, we're going to stay away from them. Definitely going to do that. Okay, so can I go through here? Yes, I can. Oh, it just leads back out here. Okay. Um. Hmm. This is a bit of a predicament. Okay, so now where do I go from here? Why did you turn around? You okay? I, I don't know what he's doing, but all right. Okay, so now I'm not quite sure where I need to go from here. Let's go back out this way without getting ourselves absolutely murdered. And we need to think about our next move. There we go. Alright. So, yeah, that room didn't have any other exits or places that I needed to go. So I'm not exactly sure where I'm supposed to go from here. Um, hmm. I would have thought that there'd be like a, a main, main boss in this area somewhere, but I guess not. I think that the, this, this might be that all there is to it. Possibly. You know what, if, if, that's it, if that's what it is, then that's what it is. So we're just going to go back down, and we're going to go back to a Sculptor's Idol. Whoops. Jump here. Oh, wait, there's a little path here that I missed. That's weird. Not need to use that. Need to use this. God, so slow. All right. Okay, so we're gonna go back to a sculptor's idol, which is down this way. Uh, 
Yep, it's right down here. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go... Oops. This way. Ah! Well, shit. There we go. Up, up, up. Whoa! Hello, doggo. How did I not make that? Keep running, keep running, keep running. Alright, here we go. Okay, I'm gonna rest here. So, let me think about this. So there's nowhere else to go here, right? The things that we need to do are we need to return the the white uh, the white pinwheel to that uh, that guy. So we're gonna go do that real quick, actually. So we're gonna travel back to the what is it? The main hall? No. Here, right here. And we're gonna travel back here. I'm gonna give it to him, and we're gonna see what happens. And then if after that there's nothing we need to do. Then we're going to go back to the dilapidated temple. We're going to get some upgrades because I desperately need them. Alright. Hey, big guy. Got your pinwheel here for you. <laughs> they left me all alone. And I have to find the pure white flower. Where could it be? <laughs> Oh, you can give him either the red and white pinwheel or the white pinwheel. Mm. Is there something that happens if I give him the red and white one? What happens if I give him the other one? Nah, I'll, I'll give him the one he wants. the pure white flower? Oh, that's... I remember now everyone. They are children of the rejuvenating waters. And I remember I tried to find a pure white pinwheel. A pinwheel for that child. Hey, can I ask a favor? What? Could you spirit me away? I don't follow. Huh? I know about you. You're a shinobi, right? Those monks say shinobi can spirit people away, make them disappear. As if they were never there. Why do you want that? Oh, I'm sure that everyone will be wherever I disappear to. And then I'll get to see them. I'm in charge of looking after the children. After all, you can do that. Right? Uh... All I can do is refuse. I cannot. I see. If you change your mind, please, tell me. What? Wait, I don't understand this interaction. So he wants me to spirit spirit him away, whatever that means. Um, but I it automatically refuses to do so. Do I need a certain item in order for me to do it? I'm very confused about this quest. I'm not exactly sure what I'm supposed to do with that. But I guess we'll figure it out at some point. Um, okay, so... I think that's everything that I can do here because I went to the top of the mountain, yeah, and there's nothing else that I f feel I can do here. I know that there's stuff on the other side, but I don't know how to get over there yet. So, yeah, I think for now I'm going to go back to the dilapidated temple. That's like the one thing that I feel like I can do that right now. So, we're going to do that, and we're going to get some much needed upgrades while we're at it. All right. Outskirts, Labadee Temple. All right. Also, I should probably use one of the Dragon Tears to uh, get my Unseen Aid back. Uh, I think we can do that, actually. Yeah, we'll use one. Right, and I feel like that should fix whatever the dragon rots is doing to people, right? I'm glad you've come, Master Wolf. Yes. We have to give her the Gorty, that's right. This power 
It comes from Lord Kuros. It's said to be a power of the Divine Heir's Dragon Heritage. Those who have been given the power of resurrection. They are revived upon death, repeatedly. Let me know if you notice any more changes. I don't think the power of resurrection comes without a cost. Definitely not. Goodbye. See you later, Emma. All right. Uh, are you okay? You good? Nope. He's still affected by it. Okay, can't fit a new tool, but I can't upgrade. Okay. Spinning shuriken. That is 200. Let's do it. Spring loaded axe. Uh, the strength will add them to heft. I can do that. Yep. And that's all I can do for now. There's a phantom kunai, sparking axe. Okinaga's flame vent. Ooh, very cool. All right, sweet. Sculptor, I don't need your concern. I'm not normal, you see. No mere dragon rot will kill me. All right, if you say so. You're coughing and wheezing, it's telling me differently, man. Just saying. All right, and let's go ahead and see if we need to learn anything new from our boy here. Also, is there anything? Oh, box is currently empty. Oh, it's you. You may use me to hone your swordsmanship, if you like. Training, vault over, deflect, no. Come back whenever you like. If you have right. techniques to try out, I'm at your disposal. Alrighty, so there's nothing new for us to learn for the moment. Okay, so now I need to figure out where to go next. Hmm. Okay, where was I last? I was... That's right. Yep. No, I remember where we were. Okay. So we need to go back to the Ashina Castle. Yes. Here. This is where we were at. That's right. I'm starting to remember now. Because we went to the side path, which took us to Mount Congo. And then there was a path in front of us that we didn't go down just yet. Uh, actually, this is the wrong one. My bad. We need to go to the one before that one. Here. All right, this is here. Okay. And, oh, oh another remnant. Lord Kuro, it is time, Lady Emma. Yes, I know. Master Genichiro is waiting, is he not? I will return to the top of Ashina Castle. Well, that reed whistle we used before. This time, I will use it to call on you. Oh, Lord Kuro, I'm coming for you. All right. Uh, what's this? A side entrance. Yes, please. All right. Uh, before we do that, there anything over here? No. All right. Just checking to make sure. What is down here? Uh, I don't know. Hmm. More pellets, hell yeah. And what's through here? Another sculptor's idol. Seem to be going the right way. All right. Is this another side path? Be very interesting if it was. That's like two side paths in like the same place. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure where we're going now. Yeah, because that's where we ended up going at. Alright. Is there anything down here? Ashino Reservoir. I know where we are. I know where I just had a moment. I had a moment. This was in this was in the beginning. 
So what we were doing is we were going in through the back of Ashina Castle. My mind's blown right now. Oh my god, I really did not realize that's in the entire time. I recognize this little portion right here. Because that's the tunnel where we met Lord Kura at when he blew the whistle. Or when I blew the whistle, rather. And then, yeah. This was above us the whole time. That's, that's insane, man. That's insane. Okay, cool. Well, now that I know where we're going. Is there anything that we're going to be missing down this path? I wouldn't assume so. We shall see. Yeah, well, you guys have no idea that the shinobi is actually right on top of you! <laughs> I try to... Oh my god. Okay. Come on, come on. Ow! Excuse me, I was killing the dog. That's what you get for interrupting me. Rude. Alright. Yeah, I was trying to do like a stealth takedown from the top, but it did not work out. You know what? I can dream, can I? I can do my best to be the best shinobi that I can possibly be. Alright, uh... We're definitely gonna take... Ooh, we're gonna take him out first, actually. You. There we go. Woo! Oh! What? Oh, hello. Okay, well, good thing that they weren't alerted to my presence automatically. Because now I can be somewhat stealthy. Oh! I had a key! Well, look at that! Apparently I had a key this whole time. And what's in here? Gyobu's broken horn. Feigned horn spear once used by the Gyobu Masitaka Oniwa. That's that's the key that I got when oh no. That's I remember I remember getting the key to, to come back here. Because in the description, it tells me that you needed to come back here in order to get this. So, yeah, I, I remember at some point getting this, but uh, yeah. Uh, famed horn spear once used by Gyobu Masitaka Oniwa, affixed to the Shinobi prosthetic to create a prosthetic tool. Oh, the horn contracts to pull enemies in, also capable of stripping crude armor. When the horn was broken during the rebellion, Ishin praised it for its splendid shape, awarding Oniwa with the cross-bladed spear of Shuzen Tamura. Nice. Alright, I think I'll go back to the dilapidated temple in a little bit once I explore the rest of this area after that. And there's an item under here. More ceramic shards. Sweet. Alright, so now we're going to go back here. Whoop, and no, my god, not get caught by that guy. I did not even see him. Holy shit, dude. Okay. We're not gonna make the same mistake again. Let's let's go back to the route that we can go through, which is under here. And go through here. And take you out. There we go. Alright. And there's another guy over here. There we go. How did he spot me? That was literally behind a rock wall. How did you see me? That doesn't make any sense. Ow. How did you hit me? And there's another gunman over there that I did not see. Oh my god, fuck you. Swordsman over there, I'll take care of him. Ooh, okay. Ay, ay, ay. 
Oh, wait. There's a go. Who? Who? Oh, you up there. Hi. All right. Seven Ashina Spears. Shikibu Toshi Katsu Yamauchi. God, these are some long ass names. There we go. There's one. Alrighty, you know what? What we're gonna do? We are going to hide. We're gonna hide because this is not a good spot to be in. I want to get these two big guys out first before I even think about taking that other guy off. That is not up for debate. Look at him. Look how majestic man's looks. Look at his super ah oh, super cool ass armor. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Good. Ah, fuck you. There we go. Okay, definitely wasn't the prettiest thing that you've ever seen. We got it done, nonetheless. Alright. Pick this up. Okay, now, before we go on taking this guy, I'm going to heal. And do we want to sneak up behind him and take one of his lives? Or do we want to do it, like, the hard way? You know what? Let's do it the hard way. I want to I wanna do it for you guys. Give you guys a little bit of a treat. Okay, so. I'm going to get him into open space. I don't know whose moveset. By any means. Oh, hell yeah! Did it just in time. Ooh. Hell yeah, got him again. Oh, never mind. What was that? I did the Makiri counter. I don't know why it didn't work. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh, okay then. Never mind. He completely dunked on me. Hmm. Well, that wasn't what I expected at all to happen. Yeah, it was weird. I did the Makiri counter, but he still managed to have his way with me. I'm not quite sure what exactly he did to counter my counter, but beats me. But you know what? It's it's fine. Well, since we are all the way back here, I think that is a good place to stop. I'm running at about an hour and 11 minutes right now, so that should be a fair good amount of video for today and uh, we're gonna leave it off at this sorry that we got our ass kicked pretty much the entire video i was just very in my own head with with this play with this gameplay and uh, I, do, I do apologize for that i'm taking it day by day and i will not stay like this forever i just need a day or two to just kind of decompress i'll definitely get back to my uh cheery happy self at some point in time but i do again apologize that this video seems a little bit lacking from what i usually do but uh, i do promise that i will do a little bit better for you guys the next time around so uh yes i i do hope that you can forgive me for for this one well thank you guys once again for tuning in if you are new to the channel be sure to hit that like button and consider subscribing to the channel it would help me out and i would greatly appreciate any support and with that i'm going to stop the video here i hope that whoever is watching has a fantastic rest of your day and to always remember don't be constant be dynamic and i will see you guys in the next video take care and peace